What's up, everyone? Deuces Jack at VapingInsider.com. We got a new one for you today. We got the Vaporesso Orca Solo. Yeah, check it out, man. Rainbow Edition, huh? Got a nice little metal covering over the tank over there. All right, real nice little mouth-to-lung setup. 800 ma internal battery, AIO starter kit, Penton style. Let's dive down. Let me show it to you up close and personal. We'll come back on top. We're going to vape on it, talk about it. Cons, pros, we're out of here. See you down low. All right, everyone. Welcome to the down low portion of this video. Today, we're going over the Vaporesso Orca Solo. The Orca is always ready. Okay, let's check it out. Here we go. Quick tour around the box. This is the midnight blue one. All right. C-cell coil. Flash heat, metal sleeve, and quick charging. On the back here, we got a all-in-one pen style starter kit with a C-cell coil. All right, metal sleeve. Let's see. Capacity is 1.5 mLs, 800 ma internal battery. In the kit, you're going to get the Orca Solo Kit, one C-cell coil, 1.3 ohms, good from 7 to 12 watts. Another coil that's 1.3 ohms good for 7 to 12 watts and a Vaporesso USB cable let's open it up and see what it looks like here we go good looking blue I like that already really really nice color all right let's see what we have here here is your typical Vaporesso USB cable they do a great job with their cables always high quality here is your warranty card here is your instruction manual, okay? Another instruction manual in another language. And here's the English instruction manual, okay? Let's see what the coils look like. These look like some small coils. This one looks like the regular 1.3 ohm coil. Very small wicking ports over there. Down in there you can see we got like a regular coil with some cotton in there. Very, very slim. Looks like a real mouth-to-lung coil. Okay, here is the C-cell coil. Same thing, 1.3 ohms, but this one has some ceramic in it. Looks like the wicking ports are actually a little smaller. If you look down below, you can see, there's, you can see the ceramic on the top there. Okay, really, really small coil. All right, let me show you the tank and the mod. Tell you right off the bat, I'm really digging the color. Loving the drip tip, okay? 510 style drip tip with a nice little curve in the middle. I really like that, all right? Metal cage comes off just like that, okay? Glass comes off like that for easy cleaning. When you want to install the coil, you just slip it in there, screw it in. It's got some nice threading over here so you can get a grip. Put your glass section back on, make sure it's nice and snug, and then you put your metal section on and you screw it down. You got one airflow slot over here that's fully adjustable with stoppers on both ends, okay? Here is your fire button right here, okay? Here is your USB port for charging. On the bottom, you just got like a little serial number and that's about it. Really, really good looking mod. Very easy to use. Five clicks on. Hit the fire button to vape. Five clicks off. Safely put it in your pocket. All right. Not much else to go over here. Let's cut back on top. We're going to talk about it. We're going to vape on it. And then we'll go over cons and pros. Then we're out of here as usual. See you back on top. All right, everyone, welcome back on top. And you just saw the Vaporesso Orca Solo up close and personal with yours truly. All right. Hey, man, I'm digging this little kit. I'm not going to lie. I like the C-cell coil. It does real well with Nick salts, okay? It's got one amp charging. It takes about 45 minutes to charge. 
Once it's fully charged, you get about 190 puffs per charge, 1.5 ml capacity, okay, 16 millimeters in diameter, 119.5 millimeters tall. It's got that Omni board in it that has those built-in protections, all right, so you don't got to worry about being safe. Real easy to use, five clicks on, five clicks off, hit the power button to vape, all right, Micro USB charging, that's always a pro, all right? Comes in a bunch of colors. Blue, silver, rainbow, black, gray, green, and rose gold, all right? Let's get into the cons and pros, all right? Not a lot to go over, really. Not too many cons, all right? Only con I really have for this thing is it's a little bit on the noisy side. It is, I, especially for a little AIO kit. That's not that bad, but when you cut it down halfway, you hear that? It's a little bit on the noisy side, but that's it. Nothing that really affects the vape quality of this little AIO starter kit, all right? Let's get into the pros. First pro is going to be adjustable airflow. I like that. You can go from a loose mouth to lung to a very tight mouth to lung drawer. Awesome job on that. I like the metal tank piece that protects your glass. Pro on that, okay? Coils are good. No doubt about it. Both coils vape really nice. I do like the flavor on the C-cell coil as well. And I'm normally not a ceramic guy, all right? Capacity. We'll give them a pro for that. 1.5 ml capacity. Good job on that. That's a great capacity when you're running Nick salts, okay? Charges quick. Pro, okay? Does well with Nick salts. Pro, Okay? Compact, pocketable, shirt pocket, jacket pocket, front jeans pocket, back jeans pocket. It don't matter, man. No matter where you want to put it, you're good to go, all right? Complete kit. I like that, okay? You get two coils. You get the tank. You get the battery. Everything's in the kit. All you got to do is add juice. Pro on that, okay? Well built. Let's give them a pro on the build quality. They did a good job on this one, okay? Tons of colors, I love the fact that there's a color basically for everyone. If you can't find one of the colors that you like, it's you. It's not them, okay? And I'm going to give them a pro on the comfortable drip tip. I really like that little curvy drip tip. You got that little bend in the middle. Kind of nice. Very, very comfortable, okay? Juice I was using today is black unicorn nicotine salts. I've been rocking the apple in here. It's like a crisp green apple. These guys make great Nick Salt juices. Love their strawberry. Love their mango. Make sure you check out their whole line. We'll have a link down below. We're also going to have a link down below as to where you can buy this neat little starter kit, the Vaporesso Orca Solo. Okay, we'll have a link down below to our forum, vapinginsider.com forward slash forum. And hey, guys, we're working hard. We're giving you honest, full reviews on all the products. Do us a favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification button, hit the like button on the video, hit me up in the comments, let me know what you think of this video, okay? And don't go away, because we do have a giveaway. Yeah, man, Vaporesso sent me three. I don't need three. I'm just going to keep the rainbow one. But I'm going to give the other two away to two of our lucky subscribers, so make sure you hit that subscribe button. Only thing you got to do to be entered in this giveaway is... You have to be a subscriber. You have to share this video somewhere. Don't care where it is. Facebook, Twitter, Google+. Just share it somewhere. Help us build the channel, okay? In your comment, you have to comment on the video. Tell me where you shared it, okay? Continental USA only. You got to be a vaping age in your state and be able to prove it. Once I let this run for a little while, I'll contact the two winners as to how to get in contact with me so we can get with you know, all the, all the niceties out of the way, all right? And then I'll ship it out to you. Normally, two-day priority, U.S. Postal Service, okay? That's it. That's all you got to do to enter the giveaway. It's really simple, all right? Color choice is going to be random, and that's all I got for you today, folks. You guys keep living that vape life. We're out of here. We'll see you on the next one. Deuces.